The operation, due to take place today, will mean the Prince can hopefully take part in the Royal Windsor Horse Show on May 9th and also actively take part in Prince Harry's wedding 10 days later. Prince Harry favoured Windsor Castle as his wedding venue because it would be easier for his grandfather to attend, it has been reported, a close friend of the Duke of Edinburgh said, for him it is a simple choice, if without the procedure it means he cannot continue carriage driving then it is worth undergoing the operation, he will only stop when he no longer enjoys it, not because he can't do it, above all he wants to remain active, speaking about the royal wedding, he added, with convalescence he hopes to be there. The Duke retired from public royal duties last August, although it was said he would attend some events from time to time. Last June he spent two days in hospital as a precautionary measure following an infection caused by a pre-existing condition. Prince Philip has missed a series of events in recent days, but despite his withdrawal from public events, Prince Philip is believed to be remarkably well for his age. The Duke is an advocate for healthy eating and exercise. He said he more or less followed the Atkins diet and only drink in moderation. The Queen Mother also underwent two hip operations in her 90s. She had a hip replacement at 95 and then at 97 had surgery after fracturing her left hip. The Queen Mother recovered to continue carrying out public duties.